And here is what the first row looks like. 3-6, that's 18 LEDs. I couldn't quite get all of their surfaces to be exactly flush, but they are awful close, and I think the difference in heights will accentuate the differentiation in the colors over there. These all fit really nice and uh, relatively tight, a little cleaner than I had thought they might. And I'm going to be able to wire this really nice and compact and easy. As you can see, all these positive wires here are going to reach all the way to uh, one single connection. And the negative leads, those will all need an additional bit of lead uh, soldered onto them. So all these are going to have to be pulled out and one single wire attached to it before going out from there. And I'll probably do that before I proceed on the next level of LEDs, uh, just because. So uh, let's take a look at that in a few seconds here. I was really fearing this wall, but now that it's all done, I'm uh, pretty happy with it. I may need to dye that white into a something more yellow. The yellow LED itself is just about perfect. I don't think that could be any better, really. The white, I don't know, it's just a little more yellow than that. So I may be able to uh, dye the plastic or do something in that regard. So uh, next, uh, let's take a look at the back of this, actually. So it's all a nice piece of organized chaos going on. I attached a lead to every negative and just brought that out into the purple line. And then twisted all of the uh, positive resistors themselves together into one big mess. This should fit the uh, area very well as far as the roof line goes. And everything else, of course, is just going to be lower on the back there. But I'm really happy about the way this looks. It's definitely worth doing all three. And if I could get the lights in a little closer. So the photos here indicate you can almost see the light bulb itself. So if I can get those bulbs exactly touching. And by the way, it's definitely far too bright. The whites certainly. So I got to put some more resistors on this to at least bring the whites back down more in level with that. Uh, ooh, if I can, having just put all of them together it's definitely going to be more of a hassle to be able to figure out what went where so there's a look at it right now they are all pretty close to right there now I'd have to untangle all of ew, all of these well it'll be worth it because that's definitely too bright relative to the yellow so it's got to be done So, uh, more to come. And here's what I'll be masking it with. Simple Captain Tape. Makes it nice and yellow. Very similar to what's going on up there. At least close enough. And it's not quite that white before, and it tones it down just a little. So that's going to be just about perfect. I'm going to continue on here and see how it goes. Take a look at the back nowhere near the mess that I thought it could have been but it's still a little rough at this point but workable okay so I'm about to do the last one of these uh, triple doodad things and I figured I'd at least get it on the record for how I'm doing it <clears throat> basically I'm just lining up all three then I've either been going for that negative leg or just going and twisting all these resistors together here at the end. Then once that's set, try and get the length here to match again. And when that's done, get it in this clip. For as quick a solder as possible. So some have gone a little easier than others. 
this one just wants to be a little bit of a pain. So this is the second time I've <clears throat> missed one out of three. It's not too bad a situation. Just a matter of relining them all. And uh, another little dab of solder. Let me start all over. Okay, and then from here, it's just a matter of pulling out a little of this Captain Tape, sealing one side off, and that's pretty much that. I try to get as close to the LED surface as itself so that <clears throat> there's very little chance of uh, any crosstalk on these wires and then fold it flat and then I'll put one more wire around this area here once I get all the rest of these taped off